Um, this is the first time Eve's ever been in the yard with no leash on. She's she's being boring. Did he close that door? Eve, you're doing so good. Oh, she doesn't like that rock. Go, Evie. <laughs> Sarah's living her best Florida life. She's got a fruit smoothie. And a babe. And a babe. Eve, go. Eve, go. Don't look at me. To, go. I want her to run. You're walking on seashells. Like a little princess. All right. All right, we're going to the beach, but we're gonna try to go to the state park. I think Aunt Dad's gonna buy like a family pass. The Dalnor Wiggins Pass State Park. This is supposed to be one of the top ten beaches in America, Mr. Sicard was saying. And I think we're gonna try to go here. The vlog's done. It's 11 a.m. I already went on a bike ride this morning with Mr. Sicard around, so uh, mm -hmm. we're very, very close to the water. Yeah, we're super close. I live like maybe a quick walk. Um, so yeah, we don't really know what's going on until we get inside. Oh, I see a bike path, a bike crossing, a golf cart crossing, turtle crossing, and people crossing. Share the road. Look at that turtle. We're in. We're in. And guys, this is, I've, we've never been to a state park in Florida. I know. This looks gorgeous. So and we're not even there. I, I walked. It's up. like, it's weird to see like brush but with palm trees. Yeah. Like we're used to like fir trees and like oak trees. and. Yeah. I'm super excited to get in the water. We got our GoPro, I think it's charged. Um, the red tide's been here, but I, with me and Mr. Sicard went on a bike ride this morning. He showed me the beach that's at like a couple blocks south of here. Water was warm, it was clear. Beach was pretty clear, water was clear. So I think they're like still giving a moderate red tide warning to this area, but it's clear, like it should be fine. If you wanna know what red tide is. Google it. Just Google it's nasty. nasty. We're at the beach. We're gonna go swimming. Violet's already out there. Violet's already out there. Yeah, Look, we've got fun. our setup here. The vlog is uploading on Sarah's phone right now. We got unlike what we unlike uh, St. Pete's, we actually have the GoPro with battery and memory card because we forgot both those last time. <laughs> so we're just gonna have a good relaxing day. The water's cleared up a lot. Yeah. Let's go. Look at this beach. So it's like, I don't know, like this seems way more ocean and real than Clearwater or St. Pete's and those are the two other ones we've been to. First of all, look at this. I think it's called Oyster Crab. That's cool. But there's all these shells. But it's cool is like it gets a little deep right here, but there's this sandbar that kind of sticks out and then there's a sandbar out there that we were swimming out to. But right now I'm about to go see that one short that's, I forgot what it's called, but it's playing at Epcot. And it's before one of the newer Pixar's. It has where like the little bird swims, or like they all run up and get the get like the muscles out, and then they realize that if they wait until the sh the tide comes in, the muscles kind of come up for a moment. So that short, if you're familiar with it, is is basically going on in real life with all these birds over here. So there's a whole flock of them. If I can't get too close, I'm gonna then go out to the ocean and like walk in to see if I can get real close. Look at all these shells are pooling right here because the way the tide comes in right here. This is super fancy. And I really don't think we have much planned besides just like relaxing, doing the beach. Might do the beach tomorrow. Look at this cool shell. I've never done like the thing where you collect shells, but I've also only been to the beach three times. This is my third time. Look at this cool one. I know they smell though, if you do, you gotta like do something to them so they don't smell. But, I might have to collect one or two or three. Okay, here we are.
about for that whole week at Old Key West about stealing the fake conch flats shell. But I think, I didn't know, but. Guys, I may, I may take this home. There's nothing in it, nothing living. It's not perfect because this broke off, but I'm gonna take this and maybe I'll find a, a more full one. It kind of works out because the red tide that no one's been here to kind of investigate and look. We're back home and Eve survived, thrived, and did great. She didn't go to the bathroom inside at all, not even on the pad. Yeah. She held it all and now she is out in the backyard. There is like a ravenous squirrel on top of this power line, just yelling down at the world in anger. You can hear it. Okay, now I pull the camera. You got camera shy? Stage fright? We're just enjoying, I think Christina, Grant, and Violet are laying down. I, we all just took showers. Grant's parents are doing Grant's parents stuff. And she's just like mesmerized. It's funny, like she has this whole backyard that she's never been allowed to, to be free in a backyard before and she doesn't care. She's mad that there's a fence here. Um, Eve, um, did it, did it start raining? Everyone's taking a nap right now, so Sarah and I are gonna have these chips, the salmon, La Terrafino wild smoked salmon and peanut hummus while it rains, because it smells great when it rains, and it, nothing like a good outside sit in a little nigh in the rain, right? What'd your dad just do the other day? He shot the shit. Bought a truck. And what happened after the best thing that happened about buying the truck? We got two batches of free cookies. And they're like... They're chocolate chip. They're they were like baked like... by some, like a real human. I thought you were giving me trivia, like what did your dad <laughs> do the other day? I got sun. Blotchy got, sun. Yeah, yours is blotchy. Mine is pretty nice. So now we are just headed into Old Naples, right? The like historical area of I think Naples. we're going somewhere then Old Naples. Yeah, I think we're gonna go see the Naples Pier, which I guess is still half closed from the hurricane. Naples actually got hit really hard with Irma. Um, so half of the pier is closed still. So I think we're doing that, and then we're going to Old Naples, and we're gonna eat outside on a patio. We are. It's not too hot. Yep. Oh my god, this fun little. Because we're in Swanky Town. <laughs> There's a second floor to some of these places. Wow. The palm trees. Killwin's ice cream. The the palm trees have um, lights on them. Lights the tall. on them. Bob Baker shoes. Look at this fancy car. Giggle Moon. That looks fun. Look at this photographer. Wow. This place looks good. Steak night. Twenty five dollars. It's fogging up in here because the it's so chilly. I turned it off. I turned it off. There's a golf cart. Oh my goodness. For in on the fifth. They dropped us girls off at the pier. What do you think? I guess we can't walk. <laughs> She's very tired. <laughs> what do you have to say? Should we wait for them before we venture? Yeah. We're going to a pub with a baby. When the you're from alone. when you're from the South Side of Chicago, you can bring your baby anywhere. Sure. Look at how cute! Hello, how are you, gentlemen? Good, how are you? Excellent. After all of Grant's sass, we decided that we're eating at Old Naples Pub. I got a black and tan. They have, give you jars of pickles. We got a fan on Violet, mostly because of Grant, because he's a baby. You feel good now? You're holding the baby. You're not even sweating anymore, Grant. 
You missed the temper tantrum. Some things we won't put on the vlog. We're getting gator, we're getting some wings, and I'm gonna get the mahi tacos. Christina might get crispy coconut shrimp salad. She's not sure though. Crispy <laughs> salad with the crust. Ooh, and we're sitting outside underneath this really cool ivy thing. Look at this fanciness. Super fancy. Wow. These are gator bites? No, these are the gator bites. Those are wings. <laughs> And it's special yeah. gator mm -hmm. sauce. I'm gonna try the first one. This smells like Actually, the Holy Redeemer gator Carnival. <laughs> this is gator. I'm having a few You guys want to order dinner? Everybody know? Yeah. yeah. No worries. <laughs> it's like chicken. Tell them like the more. Really? Guys, I cracked and I panicked and I also ordered chili on top of my actual meal. I have this issue where I, my eyes are bigger than my stomach. Mm. Okay, we're back home. We're back outside. But look at this frog. I'll try to get close out of jumping. It is like for real tropical. It's like two inches long. Oh, I wish you could see it in more detail. Look at that frog. Um, Sarah just goes to lay down with Eve. And we're trying to settle down for the night and she lays down and puts her hand in her pocket. And, and found that beetle in her pocket. I think it's dead too, but... It's getting flushed. Yeah, Eve had no idea. Eve, get better, please. At hunting. Our dog has a real fancy taste now because this is a real Persian, Persian rug. And she's just knocked out snout between her paws. She's had such a busy and extravagant day. She is not used to being on the heat as much as she was today, but she also is not used to like being able to just do whatever she right. wants in the backyard. Just a lot of time out there, so she's a lot of it. Yeah, she loves it. I can't wait to leave our own house and the fenced-in yard. Um, I think we're going to the beach again tomorrow, because mm -hmm. it's more beach life, I guess, salt life. Uh, I love those Walt Life stickers that make fun of the salt life. Yeah. But we're going to go to sleep. Actually, we edited it tonight already, so I put the memory card back in the camera to do this, and we'll put it back. So don't be too mean to me in the comments if the edit's not, like, as stellar as it usually is, because that's all this one. It's good to be home. It's good to be home. We know what our goals are. We know what we hope to accomplish. And believe me, it's the most exciting and challenging assignment we've ever tackled at Walt Disney Productions. <laughs>